Hey guys, welcome to another Hello Friendly Fox YouTube video. Um, I've got the June, June 2023 Art Snacks box, and I just got this email the other day, uh, June 1st, today's the 4th, that Art Snacks is ending their monthly subscription box after July. So that's kind of, you know, some big news because they're going to switch over to a quarterly plan. Um, yeah, interesting. So what do you guys think? Are you going to, if you're subscribed to them, if you get their boxes every month, are you going to do the quarterly box or are you going to look up something else? Um, you know, there's a few others that have similar price points. So I'm not, I don't know what I'm going to do. What do you guys think? Uh, if you leave a comment below, that'd be awesome. Just tell me, you know, if you guys subscribe to something else, any suggestions for me? I don't know. I've, I've been doing shorts videos of some random marker drawings over the past, I don't know, year and a half or so. Over the last weekend, I kind of was like, it's a lot of work to do these every day. And I need to find something different to do there. So I don't know, this timing of our snacks coming out with like, we're not doing the monthly anymore and me <laughs> stopping this. I don't know what am I gonna do in this channel. I think I'll have to think about it. But if you have any suggestions, leave the comment below. For now, let's find out what's in this box. Um, feels a little heavy. Oh boy! I a green one. Cool. I could use another one as you can tell. These two are stuffed to the gills. So it's nice that they finally gave us something more than a sticker. Um, like for their birthday month. We got a sticker this time. Alright, door number one. What do you have? The menu and a sticker. Door number two. We got markers and markers. Some water tipped some king art. It's an interesting green color. Um, the art snacks pencil case, thirteen forty five retail. To celebrate our tenth anniversary, we're giving our awesome subscribers a new color of our signature pencil case. Show off your love for our snacks with this limited edition case custom made from durable nylon. With two roomy compartments, you can fit everything in your box and more inside. Next, we got two graphite grapho twin tip markers, $3.89 retail each. Wet your palette with the grapho. This water-based marker features two different tips, a flexible brush nib and a fine felt nib. Its transparent, brilliant ink can be fanned out with a wet brush and easily blended. And last is King Art Studio Metallic Pens, set of four, $6.99 retail for the set. We specifically curated this pack of King Art Studio Metallic Pens just for art snackers. Add some metallic magic to a variety of surfaces with these opaque pens. The ink is permanent, waterproof, and quick drying. You'll achieve a consistent 1.0 millimeter fine line with every stroke. These two markers I've got cool, cool gray light and orchid. Fine liner.
felt tip marker type. the colors. I don't know what I'll draw, but maybe I'll figure that out. Markers, I like them. Um, no mechanical pencils, no brushes. Maybe this is a decent box. Um, got another bag to sit on my desk. Fill it with more stuff. Alright, so this has been my Art Snacks unboxing and uh, Art Snacks challenge drawing. Um, I drew my character like in a outer space galaxy outfit. He's traveling somewhere in the far off beyond. Um, so he's got a nice globe helmet that barely fits his uh, afro. <laughs> and some computer type equipment on his back. The stuff in the box, uh, let's, the Art Snacks pencil case it's pretty nice i mean i have two of them as i showed and you know this green color kind of mimics the green paper that they would wrap the supplies in every month so i, I kind of like that um it would have been cool if it was like a different type of case just to try something different but i'm familiar with these cases so i like them and no really complaints there so it's pretty cool um the two graphite grapho twin tip markers these are really nice. I like that it was um, a brush tip on one end that you could feather out with water. And then the other end was like a fine liner of the same color. So you could, you know, work in values in different areas and, um, you know, get some detailed work with the, the point of the pen tip. The purple was a lot darker than the gray. So I just kind of used the gray like a shadow and then the purple was the main color for me besides these uh, King Art Studio metallic pens. Now these have a nice um, nice color to them that works really well on top of black and I called an audible and used one of my black markers from a previous Art Snacks box. This mono twin I think it's about out of ink but it, it was just enough to co cover this page and that way I could get this, you know, this background that looks like he's in outer space or something. These markers are metallic pens. Um, you know, they, they work like markers because they had like a felt tip to them. You know, they're, you know, like it says, they're consistent and quick drying. So I like that. I like the, the color selection that they came with. You know, it works together, even though I didn't really make any 
patterns or anything with them. I just kind of made some lines, but in all I liked how it worked out. Um, so yeah, this is my drawing and thanks for checking out my unboxing video. You know, it looks like this might be the second to last one that I'd be doing for our snacks on a monthly basis. I haven't decided yet if I want to do the quarterly ones or not. So what do you guys think? Are you going to do that? Are you switching? Are you changing to a different box completely? Are you just browsing around YouTube? You know, I'd, I'd appreciate if you guys leave a comment below, you know, let's, let's talk. Um, let me know what you're all about. Um, did you like my work? Did you get other colors in your box? Did you have any thoughts? You know, how's the weather where you're at? Anything, just talk to me, you know, just let me know what's going on. Uh, I haven't decided what I want to do on this channel. If I want to go back to doing shorts um, or do something different, I thought maybe I, sh I could draw like something once a week, make it a two minute video instead of a 30 second, 15 second video every day. I had so much going on right now. I had to take a break. Let's see what's going on. Maybe I'll come back to it. Maybe I won't. I don't know. Anyway, that's all I got. Um, have a great day. Keep drawing.